Right, today we're out at Melden Reservoir. That's Charlie Brown and Coke. Whoa, Charlie nearly fell in. Let's bomb up this hill and check this pond out. Look at this. We made it. Alright, see if we can get underneath this thing. No way. What the hell? It's so awkward to get in and out. There's no door, so we have to climb through. <laughs> Um, just, it's just like an open thing. Just... Look at the view. See the footpath is above us, but it's kind of cool coming underneath. Oh, this place is crazy cool. Cool. I don't drink it though, it's probably gross. Right, today we're out at Melden Reservoir. We're gonna do a little mission around this thing. Then we're gonna head across the valley to the viaduct. And we're also gonna go and check out a quarry, an old train, an old truck, and I think there's an addit as well. I think there's water pouring off of it too. Right, so as we come around this corner, we're going to see a viaduct in the distance. And there's a huge mine and a quarry over here. This is what we're exploring today. There's abandoned trains, abandoned trucks, abandoned buildings. I think there's a cave and an addit. And hopefully in a second we'll see the viaduct too. We're going to be climbing underneath that. I know that there's a footpath that goes over the top. But there's also another footpath underneath, which we shouldn't go on. Which we're going to get to. They okay, were in the middle. Danger. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's uh, that's usually a danger. Right there, literally right there. That's the. It's called a viaduct. Yeah, it is a bridge. Yeah, I didn't know. Uh, I didn't know why they call it the viaduct. You got it. Right, shit. Let's go on the other side. Ew. Whoa. Can you imagine the amount of water pressure is to the left of us right now? Yeah. Can you hear the chop? Oh, cool reservoir. We had to come down and have a proper look at it. Imagine sliding down there. Let's avoid this bog. Charlie, you're going to get your feet so wet. We're going to try and get across the other side, up and around. It's a bit windy down here. That's very strong. That does look strong. I wonder if we can cross. So before we head to the viaduct, which is just, what, it says viaduct, but before we head to the bridge, we're gonna head down to this car park on the other side. There's a few buildings over here. Uh, and there's a few little bits of quarry there, out rock we can go check out. Pretty sure we're not supposed to use it like that. Nice, Charlie found a goat. It's so tiny. Just gonna go and check out these buildings. Stand inside this little quarry out area. 
and I think we're going to take a walk around over here. You can just see if I zoom in. There's a really cool little blue lake. There's a crazy cool rock there. So we're going to go and explore around that one. There should be some abandoned buildings. There's some kilns over there as well. Oh, someone's on a spaceship on there with Ollie's name. <laughs> I spelled it wrong. So no, dude. Wow. A big old machine. Whoa, Charlie nearly fell in. Definitely no holes in there anywhere. There's a building over here though. And past the little bog. Wow, I wonder what's in there. Whoa. Well, all the way to the river. Okay, right, let's have a look at this building. It's got some breeze blocks sections but I reckon we can still get in there from the other side. Kind of cool huh? Hey. Let's have a look through the gap. Yeah. Wow, let's get the torch on. No building, there's all these there's some machinery and stuff in here. Shoe. A shoe? I can see a shoe. A lot of rubbish, a lot of new rubbish. <laughs> see? Ah. You stood on your brother's oh, foot. Very oh. good, isn't it? I think there's some buildings just in like this area here. So we're gonna like we'll walk around it and then we'll see if we can see these buildings over here too. And we just turned around and found another building. We need to get up there. It's a shit house. Oh, right, okay. Good view to have a poo. Oh, yeah. Huh. Yeah, look at the view, though. Come out, wipe in your bum. Stand over everything you, uh, you own. Wow. This silly bar by here, it's dangerous, someone could trip over it. <laughs> wow. We should get up onto that bit, I want to get onto that ledge. Is that a bird of prey up there? I think it is. River crossing time. Really? I don't know if you're brave or stupid. Wow! That was awesome! Ollie jumped from there, Chop. All the way across. This, this is the fun bit now. Charlie just fell over. Such a wally. So this uh, is uh, where the wobbly bridge is. There's a dog over there too, look. This is wobbly, this one. You feel it wobbling? Look at the state of that. That is a wobbly bridge. Feels solid. This is the best part. This place is amazing. Just bomb up this hill and check this pond out. Look at this. Hey, mallard ducks out there too, look. This place is insane. What do you think, boys? See that rock formation on the other side? Yeah, like get the phones out, take some photos. This place is sick, right? Yeah. Kind of nice if we could feed the ducks. Let's get down to the bottom here. Such a cool rock formation. It's just sheer edge over there. Wait, Ollie, roll 
No, look. Oh, yeah, <laughs> so I know there's kilns on this on the right hand side of the river and I can see there's some structures over here too. The ripples look cool. Charlie and I thought we saw a little hole over here, so we're just gonna go and check this out quickly before we see these buildings. Can't determine whether that's a buttress up for something or the entrance into something, but check that out in a second. Let's go and have a little look over here. People are camped out here, and this is not a bad spot to camp out. It's just a shame they didn't hide their uh, rubbish. This is private land keep out. The lake is extremely dangerous uh, with underwater obstacles. The lake is surrounded areas, strictly private, no unauthorized fishing, camping, or open fires. Thank you very much. This is what I was looking at. No, it's just a bit of a dark gap, but always got to check. Oh wow, looks like another massive kiln. It's all been filled in at the back, unfortunately. Pretty sure there's a nice example on the other side where the back is actually still open. But look at the strange details in this rock here. Yeah. You saw that too, huh? Look at that. Oh, interesting. It's all natural. Oh, that? <laughs> Whoa. You see the metal rail underneath it, walking backwards and forwards. It's a solid bridge, we're all right. Made it to the bridge. I'd like to go camping soon. As we climb up this massive hill to the top of the bridge, chatting about our future plans. Spring is sprung. Spring sprung. Yeah, man, we gotta get camping back on again. These are starting to show up on the trees, you see catkins there. Little cattails on the trees. We made it. Alright, see if we can get underneath this thing. Hmm. So, this is the top there where everyone else rides. We're gonna go on the underside. So, the purpose of this uh, cycle track or walking trail um, in the past was for a train, very similar to the Drake's Trail we have down in uh, Tiles Dock and in Plymouth. Obviously, this is the Oakhampton one, so there we go. That's where we started, all the way over there. Right, so we're going to walk down the abandoned train track. This is obviously now a cycle trail. There's a bunch of buildings here, look. Meldon Visitor Centre. I think there's a little ladder over here. I found like a little entrance. I'll be prepared to pay 200 quid for this adventure. This is the old train track. The train used to stop here, let people off. This is where I found the hole as well, in the rock. Literally just here. Try and get up in these things, shall we? We're in. No, leave the bag there. Look behind you as you get in to make sure there's nothing, no one looking. Okay, in you go. Cool, huh? Oh, wait, no, I have been on the streets. Yeah, right, so look there. Just be wary of the windows because someone could see us through there. Wow, this is so cool.
Yes, Flip. Lots of glass. I wonder if people just hang out in here and have a few drinks and stuff. Probably. That's what one jack for the post, that's what you wanted to do. Yeah. Yeah, I hope there are. All well, the mirrors are still in situ. So cool. Anything in there? Yeah. So the next carriage, we're going to try and climb up through the gap in the middle and then we can get in through this back way here. So we have to go back out. And around. Okay, right, we've made it. I made the slide through there. I had to take my coat off because I couldn't fit through. So look. This train's got to offer an ending. Wow. This train looks much more legit. There's a folding table. Wow. Okay. This has been secured really well. Electrical table. There's no steering on a track, you plonker. Oh, shit. <laughs> do, do. There's probably a fire extinguisher in there or something. No way. What the hell? It's like a living room in here. Look at this. It smells lovely. There's like wood in here. Oh, look. Laboratory 11 restoration this coach was restored between 2012 and 2015 by volunteers of the Dartmoor Railway Support Association carriage and wagon team. Wow. The front's completely empty. Yeah, but it's been restored this thing, look. People have been in here tidying it up, cleaning it up, trying to restore it. How are they getting? Look at the far end. All pipes and stuff. Where's the front of the train? Wow, how cool. So, what is this room then? The, the, the defects the book, book, vehicle check yeah. book. Uh, yeah. 2016. 2016. Huh. Shut this window. No way, the window does shut. Nice. Oh, you could sleep in here, really, couldn't you? Okay, that's pretty much the train exploring. That's this tiny little. What have you got in here? Electrical cables, little ladder. What a cool ass train, man. What's under here? That's screwed shut. Stop. Yeah, yeah, start, stop button. <laughs> you imagine if this thing fired up, it'd be scary as hell. Wow, there's a big old engine there, it looks in good condition too. Okay, you go down first then. Go on then. You mean on um, Saturday, Sunday? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, Charlie's gonna slide down. There's this cool little digger over here. I'll go and check this out too. If we can get out there. Oh, I can get down. This thing was sketchy as heck. And the chest only just fits through. Man boobies. I'm not even on the ground yet. Okay, I'm touching the ground. Oh, shit. Down that hat. That hat my back. Okay, you 
get out, okay? It's so awkward to get in and out. There's no door, so we have to climb through. So, nice. Okay, so we are trespassing, so we're trying to be on the DL. Let's go and check the yellow digger out. This thing is wicked. Can't help themselves, look. There's a van just around the corner from this building. So we don't want to get caught, but the kids, look <laughs> what Ollie's doing. He literally can't help themselves. He's Charlie's in the back. They love it. It's a cute little digger, huh? What? What? I'm sure they had a lot bigger trucks and stuff around here than that, though. But that is a cute little thing to keep around here. A big old engine on it, too. No doubt it's probably got a giant turbo. And it weighs a hell of a ton. That was definitely worth the adventure. That was cool. What a nice train. All right, let's go and check out the sea what the coast is like, and then we'll go around the outside. Okay, right, so we're, we're back at the top side. There's a building up here. There's an adit or a tunnel over here. We're gonna check this out, but we're gonna jump into this little hut over here. Take five minutes to rest. Prepare ourselves. Can you see that hole over there, though? Can you see that pop right in front of you? Okay, right, we're just taking uh, five minutes time out in the hut, and then we're gonna go across the other side. The door is just behind here. Really tough to see. And then we're gonna try and get up top here, too. I reckon we could probably just climb straight up. We can go around this way, not? Cool, right. We've chilled out in the station. Let's get to the other side and check this hole out. Okay. Let's get around these bushes. It's so fun. It's so fun. We're doing all these things we're not supposed to be doing. Ow, ow, ow. Step into the side. It does smell a bit in here, doesn't it? Can you get it? Okay. If Wally struggles this much, how am I going to get through? <laughs> Do you need a hand? Jeez, is your foot? <laughs> That's the least elegant way to get into an addict. Okay, right. <coughs> Box. I think we might be trying to climb over for nothing. What? Ah. Uh, it's just like a... Did you use the camera? Oh yeah, I forgot. Don't get it. Um... What's in there? Just it's just like an open thing, which has loads of like scrap stuff in it. Historical and underground display. There are no bats that I. It's probably not worth coming in there. No, it just goes in. And... I mean, there's a door. Um. It's pretty empty, nothing really. Well, that was that was cool. I'm glad you. Uh, I'm glad I've got kids small enough to still get in the holes because uh, I just tried to put my chest up against that gap. There's no way I was getting through there. Oh yeah. Oh shit. That's it. Charlie's a, just, I, I, he just I bent in half then, didn't it? It's weird. Just... That's where the boys climbed in. And obviously this is the door on the other side, right next to this gate. 
There's the big door. So that's just a little storage area there. So I'm wondering whether we should start walking up this way and get to the top. This place is amazing. Great place to explore. Okay, right, I'm gonna, oh, that's a shot. I'm gonna head out of this place. I'm gonna get around to the end and up. Right. I can see the buildings here, like. Right on the top of that hill, above where the attic was. Quite a dreamy camping spot, isn't it? Yeah. Look at these. I go swimming in there. This hut. What does it do? Oh, it's just like a little hut. There's something in there. There's not an awful lot up this way, so we're going to head back towards the uh, the bridge and see if we can climb underneath it, cross underneath the bridge. To get under this bridge, you've got to go this way. There's an old footpath that leads underneath the bridge. It is slippery, it is made of wood, but I think it'd be cool to walk across and walk underneath. Wow. This is so cool. I need my bag. This is so cool. There, every so often there's these little bits you've got to step over. Look at the view. See the footpath is above us, but it's kind of cool coming underneath. I think we're trying to make it the halfway to where the uh, to where the river is. Another day out exploring. We are allowed over this bridge, but he's supposed to take the footpath above us. We decided to climb the uh, the steelworks underneath. We've got to be quick though. There's people below us. We didn't see them there. Wow, this place is crazy cool. Right, I think that's it. That's the end of the video. We've done our exploring. We've been to the quarry. <coughs> it's cool around here, isn't it? Yeah. So this is Malden Quarry. So this is uh, just south of Oakhampton. So if you want to come and explore this place, uh, yeah, just uh, find them on the map. We'll need some uh, GPS locations for the uh, places we've been today. Uh, but it is private, so um, yeah, you're not supposed to be up here. I mean, you can kind of tell. You can kind of tell. <laughs> right, so that's the end of the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. See you in the next one.